Your Mini's multifunction steering wheel provides a variety of easy to use controls right at your fingertips. On the left side are audio controls and Bluetooth and voice dialing if your vehicle is so equipped, while the right side has cruise control buttons. The audio controls are fairly simple. The arrows on the circular dial work the same as the arrows on the audio system, while the plus and minus signs control the volume of the audio system. To take a closer look at the cruise control function, step one is, well, to start motoring. Cruise control doesn't work very well when it's parked in your driveway after all. Now once you're moving, you can turn the cruise control feature on easily by pressing the on-off button once, and you will notice that a green light will illuminate in the speedometer, notifying you that cruise control is on. It's important to note that when you first turn on cruise control, it automatically goes into standby mode. You don't have to be at your desired speed yet, and are free to accelerate or decelerate while cruise control is in standby. When you do reach your desired speed, press the plus button once to set your cruise control and now you are locked onto that speed and can take your foot off the gas pedal without slowing. Once cruise is set, you are still free to tweak your speed by pressing the plus or minus buttons. Each press will either raise or lower your speed by one mile per hour respectively. Now, let's say that you see a hazard in the road and have to hit the brakes to avoid it. Well, no worries. Cruise control will then return to standby mode and remember the previous speed you had set it at. To resume this last set speed, accelerate again and press the resume button, which looks like a speedometer with an arrow pointing to it. Your Mini will then automatically resume the last set speed. If you want to completely turn off cruise control, all you have to do is press the on-off button again and the green light in the speedometer will go out.